Hello everyone, welcome to Chirac's PostgreSQL DBA tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn how to set up logical applications. Logical replication in PostgreSQL step by step on Ubuntu. So I have a two Ubuntu server. We required a two Ubuntu server that we will just do the logical replication. One is the master server, another is the replica, replica server. So what is the Postgres? SQL replication. The process of copying data from Postgres SQL database server to another server is called Postgres SQL replication. The source database is usually called the master server and whereas the database server receiving the copied data is called the replica server. So in this video we are we will see how to set up logical replication in Postgres SQL step by step on Ubuntu 22.04. So I have a pre setup to Ubuntu server that we already installed the postgres sql and login details all the details we have uh, inserted now we are going to do the logical replication and uh, for the installation and configuration you can uh, follow my another videos there already we have did the postgres sql installation now here we will start and there is uh, some steps are there so in first step we are going to configure the postgres sql for the logical replication on the master server i am going to open the postgresql.conf file that is located in the slash etc slash postgresql slash this is the postgres version i am using and main and then postgresql.con let me open this so on master i am doing that so this is my master server postgresql master server and this is my replica server postgresql and slab i am giving the name so in first server i am going to open this no need of sudo already i am logged in with the root user I'm going to open this let me search yeah. go through this <laughs> so first i am going to modify the this address that is the only local host i am going to insert the postgres db master uh, master private ip address So localhost um, I am going to put 192.168.72.128 this is my master database IP and second I am going to modify the that wall level is replica to logical so wall level is uh, comment out i will comment out the wall level and i'll put the logical let me go authentication is there ssl is there resources memory wall level. So I am going to use logical. Okay. So my work is completed. I am going to save. So there is a control X, control plus X. Then I am going to modify this buffer. Yes, Y. Then enter. So my file is saved. So this two part is completed now now i save the file and close it next let's edit the pghba post based uh, authentication file so this is the path let me open that yes
so I'm going to insert here let me copy this my possession replica sort of private IP so replica server 192.168.72.1 one two nine this is my replica and copy that and I'm going to paste it there So I inserted that data. Everything here. Now save the file and close it. So I'm going to save the file. Control X Y. So both the files are saved. Next, I'm going to allow the Ubuntu firewall allow the Postgres replica IP. So I'm going to copy and. Need this IP. So you have to allow Postgres replica IP to any. Sudo so uw one to firewall allow from one twenty nine to any port. Okay. So I am going to access from the one twenty nine. I am going to allow. We'll subdate it IP and say okay. So this is a 128 okay. and uh, my this replica is IP A. This is 129. Okay. I'm going to clear that next step after allowing that, I am going to restart the Postgres server. I need to restart on that so restart it successfully next i'm going to set up uh, set up a database and user role and table so first open the postgres sql prompt so i'm going to open that i'm doing in master just remember this uh, where i'm doing so for me okay that's not a problem so next i'm going to create a table table name is chirag logical rep so database created let me check control database is created next <coughs> i'm going to connect with the database Let me check why this is not created. Mm. Let me create with the second horse also. Sorry.
start the server and let me connect again connection of the socket help that use connection kept It's correct. On our first phrase. Okay. So problem with the name only. That's not a issue. So I'm in both the server. I'm connected with the my database. So this is my database. Now next, so I'll change this. So now I'm going to create a table. ID name product name and product price here constraints I am using the product uh, P primary key as a ID this is the code for the creating a table and paste here so create table is done so table in both the server i have created the table now next i am going to create a role name is chirag and replication with the login login password so here in master i am going to create a role as a chirag with the password admin at the right one two three the role is created next i am giving the all the uh, I'm giving all the privilege to database to Chirag user. So grant is completed. Next, I'm giving grant to privilege to all the table schema. We are using now public schema only. If you want to create the schema, table space, everything we can create as per our need. So we can do it in uh, other videos next already we did so this first part is uh, this second part is completed now i'm going to set up the publication on the master i'm going to create the my publication so publication is mechanism uh, that uh, poses sql uses to make the tables available for the replication so i'm going to create the publication on master publication is created next I am giving the publication to add table products or product table we have created 
so with your publication your place you can now add the subscriber that will pull the data from it so now i'm going to create the subscriber and subscriber is then on the replica db so this is the code you can create the subscriber let me modify that so host name is postgre master database ip so 192.168.72.128 this is the master db and uh, my database and publication in my publication just now we created i'm going to create the subscriber i'm going to the second db paste created in slot no, publisher no. so created replication slot this so everything is created now i'm going to test the and troubleshoot this is quite easy to uh, create the logical replication so i'm going to insert some data into the product before that let me check let me check on the both the both the side that any data is existing or not i'm running this query in the first side zero row affected and second table also i'm going to second uh, replica server also there is a zero rows i'm going to insert some data insert three then let me run all three are reflected there we did that all three are reflected so success everything is working fine for any doubts and query please uh, write on the youtube video comments again we are going to repeat it so in this video we learned how to set up the logical replication in postgresql step by step in ubuntu 22.04 lts and here we use the postgres in 14 so this is quite easy some steps are there or uh, and follow the video for the getting the success so we already did the replica uh, logical replication from master to replica server so hope this will help thank you for watching